It launched back in 2019 and has since solidified itself as the first legitimate competitor in pro wrestling. And now All Elite Wrestling is knocking on the Bay Area's door with a live episode coming to the Oakland Arena next month. And joining me now to discuss more is professional wrestler, wrestler Will Hobbs. Will, thanks for joining oh, thank us. Thank you for having me. Yeah, really exciting to have a Bay Area native yes. here sitting with us on the couch. From East Palo Alto. So having the show November 10th in Oakland is... Yeah. That's probably a pretty big deal for you, right? It is. I grew up going to shows there. So wow. I, it's a, I, I can say dream come true. So yeah. Man, it's it's going to be exciting. Well, we're excited to hear all the details about it. But let's kind of get into your wrestling yes. career first. Well, before we talk about the collision coming to the Oakland Arena, for you, when did pro wrestling really start? And when did you see it kind of take off? Oh, man. So by the time I came along, the wrestling was already in my house. My grandparents took my dad, aunts, and uncles to shows. So uh -huh. by the time I came along, it was already going. So I knew at the age of four, this is what I wanted to do. Wow. Okay. So at the age of four, you already knew. You had your mindset that yeah, this is something my, you Yeah. My to grandma do. took me to a show when I was six months, but obviously I don't remember that. But actually watching my first show mm -hmm. when I was four, I was hooked. And when did you get your first big break in wrestling, when you realized this is something you could do full time? Probably came during the pandemic when I got uh, first popped up in AEW All Elite Wrestling during mm -hmm. the pandemic. So we all know the world was at a still, but yeah. wrestling was still going. So I got my big break then. That's amazing. And when it comes to your character and you as a wrestler, how would you describe yourself on the stage for maybe people who have never seen you? On it, the it's stage? it's part of my uh, personality. I like to say I'm, I'm I'm what we call a heel. Uh huh. So I, I'm I'm a bad guy. You're the bad I'm guy. I'm the bad guy. Yeah. <laughs> and everyone loves to cheer me, so. Hey, everybody, also, you know, sometimes people like the villain. People like the bad guy they do. sometimes. It, it makes the best movies. It really does. So for you, how have you embraced that role so far, like you said, since the pandemic and mm. since you've gotten into AEW? Well, like I said, it's a dream come true. So all of it is going from zero to a thousand miles an hour. So mm. you just have to be on the move constantly, keep going and going. Yeah. And The Collision is a series that AEW is doing. Yes. And they're coming to the Bay Area. Yes, to the but, Oakland Arena. But describe the series to our viewers who maybe don't know exactly what it so is. So we have three major shows. So we have our... Um, premiere show which airs Wednesdays AEW Dynamite and then we have our Friday show AEW Rampage and our new show AEW Collision which airs on Saturday but November 10th we're doing a special live edition of Rampage and Collision. So it's actually a special live show it's, it's live. not pre-recorded it, it, people can gonna, be part of the live. It's gonna be live. <laughs> live TV, live cameras, trucks, everything. Uh -huh. And why why here in the Bay Area why make that special accommodation for the Bay Area especially in Oakland over there? I just think the the Bay Area is has a has a special vibe for professional wrestling just growing up here you get to you know, for me growing up, there was a lot of big names that I got to see, especially the Oakland Arena. It's just the Bay Area has its own swag. It has a special vibe. It really does. I love for professional wrestling. Yeah, and we've kind of seen that, too, even with, on this show. Um, we've had other AEW wrestlers on mm -hmm. here, so it's been amazing to kind of just see that fan base and how they really support Man, the wrestling. Man, we love it. They're, they're diehard fans. They love it. They let you yeah. know how they feel 100%. Yeah, and what's the difference between this live episode, maybe between other episodes in terms of the Collision series? I just think that, you know, we're on the road every week, and California, the Bay Area, has a special vibe. We were here earlier this year in March for uh, Dynamite and our pay-per-view revolution, so it, it just, it's just being in the Bay adds a different vibe and swag mm -hmm. that you normally don't get when you're on the East Coast or whether you're down South. Well, let's get into some of the details, Will, yes. for the collision coming to Oakland Arena. Besides yourself, who are some of the other big names and matchups that people can expect to see? You'll be able to see our world champion, MJF, mm -hmm. will be there. You know, we'll have uh, Adam Copeland, who will be in the house, Ricky Starks, FTR. So there's a, there's a lot of big names mm -hmm. that are going to be there. So a lot of big names, a lot of big matchups. But Plus, you get to see me, a hometown guy. So yeah, I think right? that's what everybody wants to see me. So. <laughs> Oh, they better. The guy, especially the villain, right? Yes, they better. They better. <laughs> I break back, so. <laughs> no big deal. I just no, break back. Just break a few back. And for you, what goes into the preparation for some of these shows? I know you just mentioned that every week you guys are mm -hmm. on the road, you're traveling to different parts of the country. But for you personally, how do you prepare for stuff like this? I, I go through my normal uh, recovery, cryotherapy, get my yeah. weekly massages. But mentally, it's just 
making sure that I get to deliver and give the fans what they want and what they expect because they're spending their hard hard earned money to see us be at 100 percent so yeah. whether we're tired or beat up bruised it's no excuse and for you what is that that you're trying to deliver to the fans what do you think that they're looking for in terms of you will hobbs they're looking wrestling? to see me destroy somebody <laughs> that, that, that's what they that's what Let's they tune real, in right? they tune in every week to see that so. yeah uh, I love that. And for you, what have you learned about yourself as a wrestler since you first got started up until now? Because it's been nearly three years. Yeah, um, patience. Patience. Patience and that, that this is something I really love. Mm -hmm. um, just like I said, being on the road constantly, meeting new people, performing, evolving with this business because it's always constantly changing. So mm -hmm. I'm up to par with it. Really just adjusting and adapting. Yeah, I mean, you, you, things can change on a drop of, drop of a dime, so. Yeah, absolutely, and, and oftentimes they really do. What is it that you hope will people take away from the performance, the collision, coming to the Oakland Arena, if they are able to attend heading in November? The, the, this is a, professional wrestling is alive. You know, yeah. there's not just one flavor of wrestling that AEW, it's going to bring all different types of excitement. Um, you'll see things you've never seen before, you know, the, the pyrotechnics, the different mm. wrestlers we have, you know, just different characters, so. Mm -hmm. And is that maybe something, or is AEW bringing something that people have maybe never seen? Yeah, I mean, we, we, we've, we're, we've been around for four yeah. years, so, you know, we're, we're still, you know, chasing everyone in the wrestling business, and we're yeah. still evolving. All right, one final question for you before yes. I let you go. The yes. final details, one more time. The collision coming to the Oakland Arena. When yes. and where people can get on November 10th, we'll be there. Uh, you get your tickets at AEW Takes or Tickets or Ticketmaster. Wonderful. All right, well, thank you so much thank for joining you, us. We really awesome. appreciate it. Thank you. Of course, and you're a Bay Area native, yes. so hopefully we'll see a little bit more yes, of you Yes, everyone in the Bay Area, Oakland, East Palo Alto, San Jose, everyone come out. So. Yeah, come out and, and support your local homegrown wrestlers, yes. right? Yes, yes. Appreciate that. Well, thank, thank you. you so much.